Oti, I do value you, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to need you guys to stand up because she is performing at the Mitchell's Plain Festival. This is an annual festival that happens each and every single year, and it attracts over 40,000 people. So you do know what it is. Not only does it focus on music, but it also focuses on food, your electronics, your motor vehicles. So whatever it is that you are interested in, the Mitchell's Plain Festival is making sure that it is catering for all of the citizens of Balapa, Cape Town. It's going to be happening at West Ridge Gardens in Mitchell's Plains from the 2nd until the 4th of December. So, Wamanja, I think it's only right that we invite Lyrica to come and join us so that she can tell us more about the performance icon if she is looking forward to, of course, this festival. Lyrica, my darling, please enjoy me on set. How are you doing? Yeah. Woo, how are you? All right. Okay. Okay, can you please just sit this side so that the people at home can get a full view of the lady that just graced us with this beautiful voice. How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm fine. Am I supposed to talk into this mic? Yes, yes, yes. yes. So this okay. is a message that the people at home can hear <laughs> everything that you're saying. How does it feel to wake up every day and know that you have a voice of an angel? Wow. Um, <laughs> it, it didn't happen overnight, mm. you know. It, I believe that singing, yes, some of us are born with it. Yeah. But it's also a work in progress. It's mm. an art. You have to work on your art. So for me, I had to work on my art. Mm -hmm. Yes, I had a voice. I love to sing, but it was always been a work in progress for me. And I think that's very important, man, you know, because it's one thing to have a talent, but if you don't hone and you don't grow and develop your talent, then there's not really much that you can do with it. Definitely. Tell us about your sound. Your, sounds very, your sound um, sounds very acoustic. It sounds very soulful. Take us through it. Okay, so basically... You know, I had to learn what suited my voice, mm. what kind of genres I was interested in. Mm -hmm. So I dabbled here and there. Mm. So I listened to a lot of artists um, and I got my inspiration from each of them. Yeah. Um, I would say I found my own sound mm -hmm. when I started producing my own music. Mm -hmm. That's when I found what genres really suited me mm, and, mm, and mm. what my voice was more open to. Yeah. So I'd say it was more in the relation of R and B, hip hop, jazz, yes. those kind of things, soothing sounds. Mm -hmm. um, but then again I don't want to box myself yes. into genres. Yeah. So I'm very open dabbling into each genre. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, and see how you can navigate your sound in, the, in those spaces as well. Take us through the production, because you just mentioned, you know, producing your own music. Take us through the production of, um, the production that you have actually now, and, you know, your upcoming album. How has that journey been leading up to that? So, I first, so Value You was mm. one of the first songs that I produced. Okay. This one that I performed, however, is a remix version. Oh. So, listeners, and people out there. <laughs> you can find my original version on Spotify. Okay. This one, however, was remixed mm. by another producer. Okay. Because I wanted something more upbeat. At the time, I didn't have the time to really produce. Mm -hmm. So, this producer, shout out to Damien Roman. Shout out to Damien. <laughs> for producing Value You, the remix. Um, he mm. did an amazing job. Mm. So, that is how Value You started. It started back in 2021. Okay. Um, so I produced that at my mother's place. Wow, all right. Yes. Look I at technology yes. taking yes. over the world. You're now able to make music from, you know, the comfort of your own bed even. Now tell us, you're going to be performing at the Mitchell's Plain um, Festival. How are you feeling? The people that are watching at home, what can they expect from your performance? Because, I mean, you've already melted everyone that's in studio today. So I can only imagine what you're going to do to those 40,000 people. Yeah, well, I have something in store for you guys. Um, I don't want to spoil the surprise. Okay. But, yes, I'm ready to blow your socks off. Ready okay, to blow your socks off. Uh, Dabble into it. A, 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 a pinch, a hint. What can we expect? Like, is it going to be, are you performing two songs? How many songs are you going to be performing? So, I'll be p performing three songs. Oh, okay. Um, so, one of them will be... Well, two of them will be an original, mm. and then one of them I decided to just cover a song. Yeah, you know that everyone can just vibe to, yes. and that everyone's familiar with. Mm. Yes, so. and I really love the fact that um, when when you know you're in a festival, you're in an environment of a festival, where everyone can just vibe to know the music that yeah. you're singing. Yeah. So quickly before we let you go, um, please let us know where we can find you on social media. Okay, so you can find me on Spotify and mm -hmm. Facebook, Leah Beats Lyrica.
mm-hmm. is my tag name mm. for both Facebook and Instagram. Yeah, no, thank you so much, Lyrica, for gracing us with that amazing performance. I hope that you guys at home also enjoyed that performance. And please do make sure that you go out and you purchase your tickets for the Mitchell's Plain Festival that's going to be happening in West Ridge Gardens from the 2nd until the 4th of November, no, December, rather, excuse me for that. But right now, we want to head over to a quick air break. Do not go anywhere because we still have more extra coming up right after this. Mm -hmm.